right, what's going on, you guys? Nick here with Nick's on the Power. So another video about Larry Wheels. Um, so recently, Larry Wheels posted a video where he's squatting 900 pounds, which is a 50-pound PR for him on the squat. But the most impressive part about this 900-pound squat and about the fact that it was a PR was that this squat was done just two weeks out from his next bodybuilding competition, two weeks out from a national-level competition which is part of his journey to getting an IFBB Pro card. Now, the reason why that's fascinating and the reason why that's impressive is because really we haven't seen too many bodybuilders doing something like that, too many powerlifters or bodybuilders doing something like that, um, besides a guy like Ronnie Coleman. Ronnie Coleman was notorious for doing these crazy um, one rep max PR setting workouts just weeks out from the Olympia. Um, and no other bodybuilders, and still to this day, not many IFBB pros, if any IFBB pros, are hitting PRs or maxing out at any point during their prep for any pro show, let alone just two weeks out from a show. Now, typically any bodybuilder would be at their most depleted um, and arguably their weakest this close to a competition, two weeks out, getting very close to peak week, very close to being as depleted as they're going to be. Um, and you would think their strength would be pretty much zapped at that point. Um, and not necessarily hitting PRs by any stretch of the imagination, let alone a 50-pound PR when we're talking about a squat that's 900 pounds. We're not talking about squatting 400, 500 pounds and hitting a PR um, a couple weeks out from a show. We're talking about, like, earth-shattering type of weight. And Larry Wheels is still a very, very young guy. Um, and I think the best is yet to come. Um, and what we're going to see Larry do over the next couple of years, because just in the past year alone, I mean, think of how many PRs Larry has set shit in the past six months alone um, in the overhead press, the bench press, the deadlift, the squat, all the things that he has done recently, um, just blowing people's minds, hasn't even been over the course of a year. So who knows what he's going to be able to do over the next five, 10 years as he tries to get that pro card, competes in powerlifting more, hits more PRs. Who knows what his highest PR is going to end up being, you know, when he's 35 instead of in his mid to early 20s. So I think, like I've said many times, what we're watching right now um, is the beginning of one of the greatest powerlifters in the history of powerlifting and probably one of the strongest bodybuilders in the history of bodybuilding. Um, and if he does manage to turn pro, get his IFBB pro card, he's, he's definitely going to be the strongest pro bodybuilder in the history of bodybuilding. There's no doubt about that in my mind. So let me know what you think in the comment section below about Larry Wheels hitting a 900-pound squat PR at just two weeks out from his next bodybuilding show. Do you think it's a smart move or do you think it's a risky move um, that that would be the time that he's most prone to injury, perhaps at two weeks out when he's at his most depleted? Maybe that's not the smartest time to hit a PR or maybe it doesn't matter because he's just simply so genetically gifted. Um, it just doesn't matter when he hits a PR. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Nick Strength and Power, signing out.